I washed my hair today, so it's time to make a video. It's like basically my criteria for making a video. Is my hair clean? Yes. The dish I'm doing today is a recipe from Nigella Lawson. This is one of my top five favorite dishes of all time. It combines a really small amount of basic ingredients. It's a one pot dish. It's like the ultimate in comfort food and it's really simple and it's really easy to make. You're basically poaching boneless skinless chicken thighs with white wine and bacon. There's something about using white wine in a dish like this that really elevates the flavor and make it seem really sophisticated even though it's a really rustic dish. I also feel like chicken thighs are the most unrated part of the chicken. Chicken thighs are cheaper and they usually have like a hundred times more flavor than the breast. When it's Christmas or Thanksgiving, which means Meat are you likely to reach for? White meat or dark? I mean, case closed. Rosemary is also my favorite herb. I usually steal my rosemary from the Tower of London Garden. It lasts in the fridge for like weeks at a time if you put it in a glass of water. It goes well with sweet potatoes, roast chicken, roast lamb, roast beef, balsamic vinegar. It's just an amazing florally herb. This recipe calls for a few things that I am supplementing. It calls for garlic oil. I'm just throwing a smashed clove of garlic in the pan with some extra virgin olive oil. It also calls for pancetta. I bought bacon lard on, so you can just use any regular bacon that you have. I would serve this with a side of steamed rice or mashed potatoes because I really feel like it needs a better of carbs to rest on. I also love this dish because it's Nigella's and I love Nigella. I think her food's amazing. She just turns me on, basically. I don't do a taste test at the end of this video because I have tasted this a million times before and I can tell you it tastes amazing. Go and make it and let me know what you think. Finally slice a bunch of scallions or green onions and smash one clove of garlic. Strip the rosemary leaves from the stems and finely chop. And quarter about one pound of boneless skinless chicken thighs. I used about 12. Add two tablespoons of olive oil to a frying pan over medium heat. Add the bacon and scallions and smashed garlic and let sizzle for a few minutes and stir. Next, add your chicken thighs. Add about a half teaspoon of celery salt, then add in the wine, about a half cup, and let it come to a bubble. Add in two bay leaves, add in a can of tomatoes and a pinch of sugar to offset the acidity of the tomato. I'm using maple syrup for this, but you can use whatever sugar you want. Give it a stir, pop a lid on the pan and turn it down to a medium simmer for about 20 minutes. When the 20 minutes is up, add in your cannellini beans, warm through and serve straight up or with a generous helping of carbs of your choice. Thank you so much for watching this episode. If you have any ideas for things you want me to make, please let me know in the comments below. If you found this video useful, feel free to subscribe to my videos. One comes out every Friday. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you have a great week and I'll see you next week. Bye.